4th Annual Portlandia Mermaid Parade. It is happening this Saturday. Cor Harlan joins us live with a parade preview. Cor? From down here at Keller Fountain this morning where the weather is beautiful, the mermaids are in the water, the mermen are in the water, and the, uh, what do you call the, uh, what do you call the half? Sakailian. The Sakailians, a half, uh, half person, half, uh, half mermaid, half octopus, are all in the water. And of course, we're previewing uh, this weekend's uh, Mermaid Parade, Portlandia Mermaid Parade that starts in Northwest Portland at noon on Saturday on its way down to Poets Beach. This is Una Mermaid right here, and that, that's exactly what our email says there, Una Mermaid. All right, so what I like about this, first of all, is that it's about body positivity. Uh, Any bodies can show up here right. and show off as much of your body as you like. I'm all about that. Let's talk a little bit about the Grand Marshal. We touched on this last half hour because uh, this is actually uh, an event intended to draw a little bit of attention to something called ghost netting, which I don't know much about, but explain sure. it to me, right? Uh, ghost nets are large industrial fishing nets that are often left behind um, either by accident um, in the ocean and they float around and they end up capturing a lot of sea life. They get stuck in there and then they end up dying. Um, and so Emily Miller, a fabulous um, artist who has been collecting ghost nets from Hawaii off the coast of Oregon and Maine on the East Coast, and she's been converting those nets into art to help educate and share and also repurpose those nets and get them out of the ocean. So she's a grand marshal here. Oh, what a great event. It's a family-friendly event here. And Jay, it's just let's just go down the line here and show everybody off here. We got a little merman here with a little glitter beard, little stars. Got a little fin on there. We we'll give you a little, uh, a little fin wave there, Jay. You like that? That's good. I hope this water's clean, by the way. I suspect it probably is well, cleaner, well, cleaner than most anyway. Anyway, down the line we go here. All the rest of the mermaids and mermen uh, dressed up with us this morning. Uh, here again from Keller Fountain. I say everybody up in the coin tower who's up in those condominiums in the top of that look down on the uh, look down on the fountain this morning. They'll get quite a nice surprise. That's my man over there on the end. That is somebody's dad, a good dad right there. We're all about body positivity, guys like this and guys like me. And the march down from uh, from the, where this starts is at the Japanese Historical Plaza. Japanese Historical Plaza. Yeah. How long is the march down there uh, to to Post Beach? And how do you how do you manage in a in a in a mermaid fan? Well, the parade route is ADA friendly, and we take our time. So it takes about an hour to process because we're not rushing, um, and we just make our way down. And you can come in a tail and a wagon and a small push float. You can walk. You can fly, I guess, if you know how to do that. That would be very interesting. Maybe but somebody catch a leprechaun or something like that. There we go. That's right. <laughs> but however, uh, however magical you want to do it, come and splash your fins at the Portland Air Mermaid Parade. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. Noon on Saturday. Weather should be great. And again, the Grand Marshal, uh, Jenny and Ken, drawing attention to uh, ghost netting in the ocean and uh, the, the harmful effects of that. But you know what? This is just a kick in the pants to come down here and splash around on a mermaid fin. For It's hard as heck to get on, uh, <laughs> but it's fun to kind of come down here and check it out. Jenny, Ken? Yeah. So can you actually walk with that on board, or do you have to just... Not very well. Not very you well. You can stand up in it. Oh. Not oh, very, yeah. No. Not very... Not, yeah, maybe standing up is not... <laughs> <laughs> you can't really stand up in it, no. Well, that's why the parade takes so long, even though it's mm -hmm. a relatively short distance. Uh, all that's that right. hopping that's around right. going on. 